Hey guys, welcome back to Clarity Chart Analysis. And in this video, I will be using the market structure to tell us our current position of phantom on the price market chart and also using market structure to predict the next possible move of phantom token. But first guys, if you are new to this channel and you want to make money on both directions of the market, you want to know our current position on the price market chart, this channel is for you. Please subscribe, like and put on the notification to be notified anytime I drop a new video. So guys, on our daily time frame, which is our major structure, the most recent break of structure we saw was a break of structure to the upside. And guys, remember my emphasis on this channel, that after every break of structure, what should we expect? We should expect a pullback. So guys, are we on a pullback phase? For us to be on a pullback phase, we need price to take out this swing on this same time frame. And guys, we've seen price trade, traded below it. So guys, currently now, we're on a pullback phase on our daily time frame and price is between this upper swing and this lower swing so guys going back to our four hour time frame let's go source for more information what do we notice okay guys this is it we notice that price has taken out this swing that gave us this ii so guys after we broke structure to the downside we'll pull back we broke more structure to the downside we saw price came back up and price did not take out this swing that give us this lower low so we saw more break of structure sorry guys sorry for that we saw more break of structure to the downside and guys currently now price is trading between this upper swing on our far time frame and this lower swing so guys what do you think do you think price will continue breaking more structure to the downside if price is taking out this lower swing that shows we are still on a pullback phase on our daily time frame and on a bearish trend on our four hour time frame but if we should see price come back and take out this upper swing that shows price is now back to a bullish trend on our four hour time frame so guys let's go back to a one hour time frame let's go see if we can get more information about market structure knowing fully well that our four hour time frame is trading between this upper swing and this lower swing so guys on our one hour time frame what do we notice after we saw a break of structure to the downside it was actually this pullback that gave us this lower low sorry it was this swing that gave us this lower low and we've seen price traded above it price pullback broke more structure to the upside and guys currently we've seen price break more structure to the downside telling us that now our one hour time frame to is bearish and we'll continue seeing more break of structure to the downside so guys our one hour time frame is bearish our for our time frame is bearish but our daily time frame is bullish so guys do you think we're still on the pullback phase sure we're still on the pullback phase because we're still on the pullback phase for us to be on a, for us to rip, resume back the trend on our daily time frame we'll need to see price take out this swing that give us this lower low and if possible price should take out this swing for us to continue the trend on our daily time frame so guys if we should see price take out this lower swing that shows one hour time frame is still bearish four hour time frame is bearish but our daily time frame is bullish but if we should not see price trade as low as this point and take out this lower swing that shows we are now back to a bearish trend on our daily time frame too so guys stay tuned to the channel clarity chart analysis is there to give updates on market structure but guys for you not to miss out Please subscribe, like, and put on the notification to be notified anytime I drop a new video. Thank you guys for watching.